Okay, today we're going to be talking about uh, the Screencast Blender add-on. And I'm going to be using 2.79 in Blender. And I'm going to try to show you the easiest way that I found out how to, uh, uh, where to go get it, how to install it, and how to set it up. So here we go. First you open Blender. Go to File user preferences come down here where it says 3d view screencast keys check it come down here to online resource right here check click it then add on catalog click it it'll open up your browser Scroll down to where it comes up to where it says 3D view. Come over here on your uh, right hand side where it says add ons. Find screencast keys. It's going to be right here on your right hand side. Click it. Then come down here to current version download. And it's going to be right here. Click it. That's going to open up the file. Best way I found out to uh, the way to save this is to right mouse click it, select all, copy. Then you can close it, I'm gonna, and then close that, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna minus my blender for a minute. Then you can right mouse click your desktop, new text document, double click it, right mouse click, hit paste, and then save as. Now down here where it says save as type, it's going to be text. Change that to all files. And then we're going to save it, I'm going to save it to my D file. And then I'm going to uh, I'm going to save it as screencast py py is uh, extension that's very important py so you save it you want to replace it no because I've already got it so and then open up your blender again then you come back up here to preferences Add it, install add-on from file. Come over here to where you uh, saved your file, screencast file. I've got mine on D, so I'm going to go to D and find it. And it's right there. Click it, and then install right here. And then you just check it, save user settings right there, and then come back over here to your, your screen. Your hotkey to open up your tab is in. Scroll down, and you should see a start display. When you click the start display, voila, it's right there. Every time you push the key now, It'll, uh, it'll be there. And under display, you can change the text size right there. Change the mouse size right there. And you can change the color right there. And that's the best way I figured out how to use it. So hope that helps.